Sagittarius have a reading for you today. We're out at the park. We got some good green chakra energies flowing. Pisces energy was great. Let's see what the universe has for you. So we're checking the energies that's currently surrounding you or the energies that are coming in at this time. Let's see what the universe has to say. Spirits, angels, ancestors, what do you have to say? For Astro Sign, Sagittarius. Using the Hulu Tarot, the Hulu Tarot deck today. <laughs> Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. <sighs> Add value to the channel so that we can continue to grow. <laughs> Sagittarius, we have the children out today, so don't mind the distractions in the background. I believe they're having their gym time, their outside time. <laughs> Grounding you today, we have Railroad Bill, Sagittarius. Okay, so that's Cancerian Energy grounding the reading today. Major Arcana. Could be major life transformations where you're looking to make a road trip or do some traveling. Could be dealing with the Cancer as well. Seven of Coins. Solid Investments boundaries or financial boundaries as well could be needing to make a, a trip to the bank but yeah definitely solid investments here harvesting looking back on your work um, getting um, diversity so diverse investment you know something in maybe crypto stocks uh, maybe you started a business mm, maybe you're investing in your surroundings pentacles are earth plane Mm, forex as well getting um pentacles what is the earth plane that's also like studios and things like that mm, homes this could be airbnbs with all these different pentacles sevens are about a lucky streak or divine timing or some something innate so you have an innate talent or innate ability to um generate finances some people don't have that talent you have black herman the magician it's number one Magician energy is Aries and um, who is it, Gemini? And master communicator, master manipulator, master manifester. It's like an alchemist. Some would call it a root worker or a magician. Black Herman, of course, one of the most famous black magicians in America. He often, uh, he was a root worker. He made plants spontaneously grow. So you could be dealing with someone that uh, that's involved with herbs. Maybe uh, Black Herman was a he was like a, I mean he was a magician. I guess magicians do a lot of stuff. <laughs> you can't even really nail it down to one thing. But someone is good at generating finances here at the Seven of Coins. Yeah. So um, Major Arcana, travel, or the Chariot. Major Arcana, magician. An innate, an innate talent to generate finances. I'm not even sure if this person has to speak to generate finances because he's looking down, focused on his work. He's not even speaking to anyone. Let's see what else the next card is here for you, Sagittarius. We have Big Mama with a sun card. Great illumination here. Celebrity moment, yes. An opportunity to advance your finances. Ooh, we got Hawks. Blue Jays. But like why does it look like the Blue Jays are chasing the hawk? <laughs> maybe you are maybe you're leading people at this time. Or you, you see them making all that noise? You hear all this noise they're making? <laughs> Alright, so Major Arcana is grounding you. We have the Cancer. It could be dealing with a Cancerian. Sun Moon Rising, Black Hermit. The magician Aries um, Gemini and then we have another major life lesson something's being illuminated at this time or you are you you're being granted a gift some type of finances or maybe a child um see legacy and lineage are two different things I don't even care to go into it right now <laughs> Sagittarius knowing about um, the long arduous journey and whatnot fourth baskets <laughs> uh, so refusing the connection at this time 
or not minding your feelings at this time. Um, some people don't. Some people just ignore their feelings. You know, that's a, that's one of the ways, or you know, not to um, not to say anything negative about it, but that's how some people manifest. Just some people realize the more of your energy, the more of your power you give away, the less of it you have of yourself to manifest. Son of coins, apprenticeship here. Mm, could be any one of these endeavors that I mentioned. You're just starting to uh, learn new things about money. Maybe you didn't care about money before, and now you're starting to learn more things about uh, money. It's like you didn't know about it before. You didn't care about it before. The four baskets. Now you're realizing the power of money. So you're generating great abundance right now, or you're um, the universe is providing you with valuable ideas. All right, man, uh, master manifestors out there, <laughs> Sagittarius. Seven of knives, unsure about some things. Mm, maybe treacherous behavior or stealing or people smiling in your face, but they're really meaning something else. So she's mixing a potion here. She's mixing a drink and she's dropping herbs in it. So this could be someone poisoning you through food, food poisoning, or you just may not, um, you may not be one of those people that just goes to people's house and just eat food. You probably, I don't eat at other people's house. <laughs> um, what else are we getting? Eight of knives. So you get, you go from the seven of knives to the eight of knives. This could be in a debate, in a debate trapped in communication and thoughts at this time could be the center of attention here with, with with the sun coming out and with the magician coming out people are all paying attention to the master manifester or if this is a type of performance or some type of concert or something like that live stream or whatever the case may be yeah seven of baskets too many it's too many onlookers at this time too many people with opinions four baskets to the seven of baskets they're bringing more confusion and more distractions at this time this is like um this can also be um mass hypnosis as well we have the magician and we have the seven of cups eight of knives people trapped in confusion or trapped in and or trapped in their thoughts ace of coins I'm also getting visit a doctor. Coins are about the earth plane. Things we use down here on this earth that was created as medicine and whatnot. May need to visit some type of, um, may need to research. Um, hmm. But Ace of Coins entails finances though. This is a new opportunity to make monies or, or open up some type of, again, studio or some type of business generate finances again could be focused on your health as well son of coins could be dealing with a capricorn or taurus or virgo laying the foundations or or the blueprints or this could be marriage as well we're getting black herman and we're getting um big mama which would be the sun and okay it's confusion though at this time there's too many options here or the perception of too many options. There's a lot of illusions here at this time. Seven of baskets. Them bones. <laughs> I forgot what the bones, them bones was. The judgment, I can't remember. No, that's the big house. Uh, we have them bones on the cover. That is, yeah, it has to be judgment. Judgment is what? The 10 10. All right. This should be the last one, all right? No, the garden is the last one. Yeah, the bones, judgment. Judgment being cast out in a situation here. It says here, um,. Do not judge by appearances, but judge with right judgment. John 7, 24. Plant, Carolina Buckthorn. 
Let's see here. <laughs> Says here, a woman puts her hand over her mouth in shock at what the bones on the table revealed to her. Hmm. Astra gallomancy, meaning divination using bones or dice, was practiced by indigenous American and African people. Divination with bones requires the reader to associate different meanings with each bone based on where and how they land. The bones of chickens, cats were most commonly used, but other, but other small and medium-sized animals were also acceptable. Contrary to popular belief, the choice of which animal to use was strictly up to each individual root worker. A set of them dim bones could include not only the remains of an animal, but also other items such as keys, seashells, and crystals. Like other forms of divination, all the items in a reader's set had clear associations. But it's a reader's innate talent, and um, but it's a reader's innate talent that determines determines its accuracy. Basically, judgment. So of course, the divine is stepping in to cast judgment down on a situation. You may have not been paying attention, or there's, like I said, been some type of mass um, hypnosis or some type of mass illusion that's been placed on the collective. This may be a hidden talent that someone possesses. Here, with it being seven or innate talent. Again, we have the magician or the man and master, the master manifester, ma master communicator, whatever you want to call him. You never know if he's a good or a bad person. You judge people by their actions. Hmm. But that is your reading for today, Sagittarius. You have Major Arcana, Black Herman, the magician. We have the sun. And we have them bones, judgment come out. So, it's either... I'm, I'm kind of getting a, a make, up, make or break situation, but with, it, with the divine stepping in, and I'm seeing this is almost, again, they describe um, the Mancy that she's doing here on the cover card as some type of, um, she used dice, like some people use dice. I'm thinking that you should take a gamble and open up this business. This can be um, a spiritual business as well. We're seeing you have a lot of options here. People perceiving you as having a lot of options here, or you're enlightened in some type of way. Sun card. Big Mama trying to give somebody a, a plate of cornbread. <laughs> Doesn't that put a smile on your face? But like, share, comment, subscribe, add value to the channel so that we can continue to grow. Catch you on the next one. Peace.